Hey y'all, today we have a pen um, 5500 SSV and it is stuck. Turns a little bit like this, but I don't want to turn too much because it's really stiff. Alright, so let's dive right into it. I'm going to focus my attention up here somewhere. And then we'll go from there. <coughs> so while I'm opening this up, uh, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the bell notification, uh, as well as make comments and hit that like button also. I think this real probably just been sitting for a while, and whatever was in there <coughs> was given a chance to. Um, lock up <coughs> I'm gonna just pull this thing up If I can. Alright, I guess we'll leave that alone. Ah, we won't leave it alone, we got it. <coughs> okay, so let's loosen all these things up and get this opened. A lot of people don't, don't like these reels. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, but I think they're pretty good. As long as you take care of them. They feel nice. They feel solid and sturdy in your hands. I don't know. I, I'm kind of partial to pens anyhow. So. This thing open here, and you gotta be careful right here because you don't want to damage that uh, gasket that's inside there. Hello. That looks like a mess. Ugh. You can see, you can see that. That's a lot of coagulated and just dried up grease that's inside there. This might need a lot of work. kind of stuck all right we'll leave that on we're gonna pull this uh the rotor off Let's see if we can see anything else inside there I'm trying to look at all these gears This is one of those classic cases where the reel on the outside looks pretty good, but the inner workings or the inner gears and everything else uh, can be a 
nightmare. So we're just going to break everything down. some hair cut around it. That's nice. Pretty long. This is where we pray. Uh, <laughs> it's not coming out. <laughs> Ah, uh, okay. All right, let's start spraying stuff. So I'm gonna start yanking things uh, soon, like right now. And I'm doing this from the flat side. So just do it from the flat side, don't do it from the curved side or from this threading here. Now we can see if we can pull this gear out of there. I just think everything's gonna be stuck. Yeah, everything's gonna be stuck on this. Oh, spoke too soon. Look at that. Oh, that's juicy. That's frozen right there. And this is frozen here. So we know at the very least the bearing is bad. And this, don't know, we're gonna find out. At least the screw came out, so that's always good. Now let's see if we can get that up. Got it to turn, that's good. Ugh. Yeah, this is this is shot. Yep, so we need a new cross line at the very least. Um, at the very least, I take that back. We need a new crosswind and we're gonna need a new uh, bearing here. One or both. Oh no, you wanna spin. It spins. And that spins. All right, so this is not good. See if you can hear that. That's close, I know, sorry. All right, so that's bad. So we need a new anti-reverse, and there we go. Uh, the bearings felt all right, so we could use those again. Yep, they felt fine. Let's see if we can get this bearing out of there. That one's stuck in there a little bit. Yeah. And 
this bearing is uh, seems okay as well. Where's the last bearing that we have? Let's see if that's good. No, oh, this one's bad. This one's difficult to turn. All right, so we need a bearing for the handle side or just for the left side of the main gear. Uh, AR clutch and a pinion and let's see about this main gear. I'm at a crosswind, not an opinion, sorry. Bottom looks good, but since that crosswind gear was bad, might have issues up here. We don't. That's good. Alright, so it looks like we need uh, just a. Sorry, I'm looking just to make sure. Yeah, this looks okay. This might be alright. Uh, I doubt it. We're going to clean it up anyhow just to make sure and uh, check it out. But... Alright, anyhow. So, hopefully that helps some of you guys out there. I'm not going to show you how to put it together because I have to um, actually have to order a few parts for this. But I hope that helped some of you guys figure out how to get inside your reel if the, uh, the normal avenues of doing that are not available. Right, so there's always more than one way to get inside there. All right, thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate it. Uh, hopefully, help someone again, like I said. And please don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell notification button on the uh, on the channel. I'll see y'all next time.